Hi friends, so in this new video I will talk about the method used to find the copolarization and cross polarization in CST. Okay, so in the last video I showed you how do you find the copolarization and cross polarization in H emphasis and H emphasis. Okay, you can find its link below this video. So in this video I will work in uh, our antenna linear orientation of two elements so i will show you how do you find copolarization and cross polarization okay so in general uh, we need to, to know what does mean polarization so polarization does mean what is the direction of maximum of o file okay this is the polarization the direction of o file the maximum of o file okay so uh, to find the copolarization and cross polarization i go directly to the far part of this antenna okay so here so before uh, talking about copolarization and cross polarization for example for gain or directivity so here we need to know uh, to o file what is the direction of o file maximum of o file so i go directly here and i choose a file okay in three dimension okay 3d this is 3d a file so here i know i show i go to show what is the direction of a file the maximum of a file so if you say so the maximum in red color okay so the direction of maximum is toward z equal uh, theta equal zero z direction okay so our file our polarization is toward z direction and i can talk about theta angle okay so theta angle this is the file direction okay the file direction is toward a theta angle theta equal zero so here i go i return to for example i need to know copolarization and cross polarization for gain okay so i show this gain and i return here to choose polar uh, pattern okay so here to find uh, to find copolarization and cross polarization i have two cases i have a plane and each plane okay a plane and each plane so a plane i see that the direction of maximum of a file is toward theta so i go directly here to theta okay theta i choose theta so here i work in a file a file okay so a file here so if i need to choose phi constant okay constant angle phi i show constant angle phi so if i choose phi equal 90 degree constant 90 degree so here i talk about copolarization so this antenna this file this this uh, this uh, representation represents a file in copolarization okay so i have 90 degree for phi okay 90 degree for phi so here i talk about copolarization okay copolarization so if i choose zero degree for constant phi okay phi equals zero degree so here i talk about cross polarization okay cross polarization so phi equals zero degree is for cross polarization if i choose 90 degree for phi i talk about copolarization in a file okay so if i need to choose or to work in each file so each file is always uh, perpendicular to a file so i choose for this case phi i go to phi not theta but i choose here phi okay phi so if i choose phi equals zero degree i talk about copolarization for each file okay each plane not each file each plane okay so if i choose zero degree for phi i talk about copolarization in each plane so if i choose 90 degree 
90 degree okay so here 90 degree I talk about cross polarization for each plane okay each plane cross polarization for each plane so here uh, always we need to know what is the direction of O5 the maximum of O5 so for our case I will find that the direction of maximum is toward Z axis theta equal 0 degrees so here I talk about O plane and for O plane I choose theta and I can fix phi and I choose phi 90 degree or 0 degree to know copolarization and cross polarization if I talk about each plane so each plane is always perpendicular to a file or a plane so I choose phi for this case and always uh, the same uh, if phi equals 0 degree or 90 degree I can know if I work in copolarization or cross polarization Okay, so this is the method used to find copolarization and cross polarization for this antenna and we can use it for any antenna just you need to know uh, of file polarization and you can uh, find easily your parameters called copolarization and cross polarization okay so uh, if you have any question you can contact uh, me in my uh, YouTube channel or on my Facebook account okay so see you soon in another video